hydrotherapy treatment for children with disabilities is closely linked to movement development, getting used to water and elements of alternative swimming education, depending on the movement condition of the children. I've been working as a physiotherapist and hydrotherapist for children with multiple disabilities since 2003 and I've been working with Watsu and other aquatic bodywork since 2007. One of the most effective applications of Watsu and hydrotherapy in my clientele is spastic cerebral palsy. I developed a special hydrotherapy program, the Multisensorial Hydrotherapy Reconstruction and Rehabilitation Program for Children with Special Needs. In the Multisensorial Program, we are working with all senses with the help of singing bowls, we use fragrances, breathing exercises and all the effects of water. In this presentation, I grab one of the many elements of my hydrotherapy program which is connected to Watsu. Our priorities are reaching full range of motion, muscle relaxation, fascia treatment, stretching, postural correction, developing head and trunk control. This starts with very small movements of the head, which affects the head position, thereby stimulating the vestibular system and support head control. So we consciously used the spatial directions and diagonals. Developing body awareness, the body is continuously massaged by the water, the stimuli are also dosed by varying the direction, speed and amplitude of the movement and the body is gradually accustomed to the increasing activity of the stimuli. It's very important to break the mass movement and make the child learn conscious, refined movements and make them sense the separate movements of different parts of the body. The tool of this is making the body feel free by mobilization, moving the parts of the body individually in all directions and by making the child sense their own movements in all directions in space. Breaking abnormal reflexes and teaching children to use reflex inhibiting posture and movement are essential for children with cerebral palsy to be able to perform more conscious, mature and independent movements. As you can see in the video, if the movements are properly prepared and the right reflex inhibitory position is taken, the extensive movement of the head does not affect the extensional hypertonicity. The effect of this kind of hydrotherapeutic work is measurable, more effective than the physiotherapy only. Therefore, the effects of hydrotherapy and physiotherapy complement and improve each other. Other benefits are conscious relaxation, release of birth trauma, strengthening of ancestral confidence is a priority for children with birth injuries. Learning the different steps of getting used to water by mental and movement capability. Our aim is to help children to achieve as much independence as possible in the water, where movement is much easier than on land, to free themselves, to experience joy, happiness and freedom. Watsu and hydrotherapy stand out from the often painful treatments and operations and families always emphasize that this is a relaxation for them, the children develop without realizing the work in it, in a nice environment and through experience. Oh, oh, oh.
often external factors affect our treatment as well, such as external noises, front weather, outside temperature and so on, which affect the child's daily condition such as muscle tone, reflex activity, attention level and therefore the success of the therapy. The therapeutic period seen here covers several years. In some cases, you can see the result of two or three years of work. Exercises are not completely passive. Children are given small tasks that are part of the development. Reflex inhibiting posture, plantar support, hat support, blowing bubbles in water and use of toys. The treatment, such as Watsu for children with hypothonia, has been criticized because of the otherwise relaxing effects of warm water, but with right care and adequate use of the water's properties, these can be turned to our advantage. In this case, the resistance and depth of water play more role and is better if the temperature of water is around 32-33 Celsius instead of 34-36 degrees. The goal of development in case of children with hypothonia is partly different, such as muscle strengthening, the improvement of postural reactions and head-body control. 
In addition, hypotonia does not necessarily mean better retention or lack of hyperkinetic movement or lack of abnormal reflexes, so their treatment is also very important. In the last video, you can see an advanced lesson. Here we are at pre-swimming level, so it's the result of working three years with the multisensorial hydrotherapy reconstruction and rehabilitation program. Hopefully, water will always be part of the child's life and a medium where she can be free, move independently and experience happiness, joy, freedom of movement. So it can be said, that Watsu and hydrotherapy affect our children in all aspects of development and its long-term and lasting effects stay with families from birth for a lifetime. Hey, my daughter.